Oh shit! What time is it? It's time for the Royal Goose! Hey everybody. Hi. So I just showed Elliot this really cute video of my dog Cody. And uh, it's a minute long, but I'll show like five seconds of it right here. <laughs> so yeah. Cody just really wanted those hot tamales and chocolate. My um, the the girl I'm seeing right now, she the day that she met me, the day that she first came over to my place, mm -hmm. she brought me that little plastic bottle full of chocolate and uh, a box of hot tamales, which was very very sweet of her. And Cody, love hot tamales. Cody just really wanted wants them for some reason. <laughs> I tried to give him food and he was like, no, fuck that. I want the hot tamales. Poor in the Milky, Cody. Milky Way and um <laughs> and hey, um while I'm uh, speaking here, uh here's our artist of the day. Wait, before we do that, James, can you write down or some shit just for our own sense? Okay. Our microphone sensitivity is at 95 right now. Sure. Just keep track of that. You can even cut this out. Okay. Sorry, viewers, if you... Oh, my God. Yeet. Oh, no. Not this oh, crap. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, I remember this. Okay, sorry. Yeah, artist of the day? Our artist of the day is... Do I have to shoot that? Yeah, you have to shoot them and make, I think, maybe chunky? Wrong. Oh, oh, wait, okay. It's actually not as bad as I remember. Okay, I was thinking... For some reason, I was thinking it would be like Mario Sunshine's casino... Bull crap or it's like so sensitive and touchy and when you're trying to shoot the panels and <sighs> the one that's messed up. I think so. No, I think that's fine. I think it's just a oh, oh, right. oh, oh, I didn't see that. Whoops. <laughs> nice. Okay, wow, that was much easier than I thought. Yeah, ye Yeah, so the microphone is at ninety five? Yeah, ninety five. Sorry about that. I just want to make sure that we know because I think our audio is really good. I think these are going to turn out better. Okay, so here's our artist of the day. Karen Cunningham. Hi, Karen. Yeah, so she... Um, we were going to mention you the uh, last episode, but I made it an executive call <laughs> to save you from some stuff. An executive business call. Our lawyers at Royal Goobs and financial advisors could not disagree with us even more to talk about her right after mentioning the Alabama wet wipes. Is that what they were called? <laughs> well, there goes that again. Okay, so... <laughs> anyways, <clears throat> here's Karen Cunningham. So there's this really cool trippy one. Wait a sec while I distract eyes. you. Um, and then here's this really cool one with uh, the two ladies getting intimate in the pool. I really like this one. I really Yeah, like I the, like the artwork too. Yeah, it's, it's kind of like uh, the previous artist we mentioned. Um, I want to just jump off of here. Um, maybe? I know oh, there's- Oh no! Oh, okay, so it's nighttime. Ah, uh, great. Alright, it's fine. See, her stuff's a little bit like Kelly McKernan's, but uh, yeah, no. I Go like check it. Out her stuff. Her stuff's really cool. Yes. I really do dig the- I, I'm thinking if I ever do get some nice artwork for my place, kind of like the artwork you have here, anything kind of rainbow, rainbowy and trippy and colorful. No, it's kind of like that one. Yeah. Well, that's not really trippy, but- it's rainbowy. Yeah, you know, just a variety of colors. Something, yeah. something, because those are just the kind of visuals that I enjoy. Yeah, I like this stuff too. But actually, the longer I've had it, the more I'm like, I'm ready for something to change. Like, I really like the artwork from us, like the pictures I've taken, like the, all those and stuff. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I think in part because like I did it, I took those photos, and Jen took those photos. So you feel it's, you it's more it. personal. Yeah, I got gotcha. you. I also like your giraffe, your rainbow uh, giraffe. I like that there. one too. That one is one of the only ones I don't really get sick of. My favorites are this one and the giraffe and then <laughs> my own photos. Oh, this part right here, yeah. This is where you come into the level? Um, no. This it's is like a, a big worm or some shit. I believe. Okay, oh, we've already been yeah, here. We have. I'm trying to figure out where we have. Oh, wait, you know what? But let's go here right now. Um, We can go back in. And use Diddy Kong, or Donkey Kong and hit the blue switch. Yeah, yeah. I want to do that while I still remember it. Good thinking, bro, because this level Jones. is freaking... I would like to finish this level in this session, but we'll see how that goes. Just because coming back to this level is going to suck if we yeah, don't right, do yeah. it all in one sitting. Yeah. And I know what I mean. Yes, I, I know exactly what you mean. <laughs> um. Right here. Oh, yeah. Yeah, good memory, dude. Boom, baby. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
Oh, hey, you know what else I wanted to talk about? What's that? Did you ever play the Borderlands games? Um, you know, I think I tried a demo of Borderlands 2. Okay. And it was the very beginning of the game. Oh, and you're, like, talking to Claptrap, I think. Oh, yeah. I just remember, like, the, the funniest line that stuck out to me was, like, you know, Claptrap. He's talking in, like, this, this really pleasant, cheery voice. Oh, yeah. The best line from that demo for me was, like, the... I may sound really happy right now, but there's actually a malfunction with my voice box. I'm actually really depressed. Yeah. I'm actually really depressed. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that was really funny. Um, but no, aside from that, no, I, I don't Do you know, know anything. know the code? I... Uh... Yeah, well, just guess it, man. Two? Hmm, it's probably written somewhere. I probably. Think it's probably written somewhere in the level, and we just have to memorize it and then come back. Ow. Okay, so it's two, one, three? <laughs> Maybe. Alright, two is fine at first. It could also be Yeah, it could two, be two, two, two. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, baby. Okay, so two, one. Oh. Two, one. You know what? I, I could just look this up online, too. Save us some time. Uh. This level's gonna take a while anyway, so... Two... Two, one, two? Fungi Forest, Donkey Kong Switch, number code. Damn it, no, not for... Okay. Don't worry, dog. Fungi Forest, don't worry... Elliot, you points. ruined it. It says, don't worry, Fungi Forest. Don't worry, relax. Uh, it's two, one, one. Elliot! Shut your fucking Just mouth. type it in, motherfucker. No. When you're in an area where uh, other people are talking, that's when you should use the keyboard. I just well, get really annoyed with autocorrect and bullcrap. God damn, I get annoyed when I'm trying to talk on a show and you're like, No, I have to talk to Google. <laughs> uh, I still remember that episode of Spyro when you were telling me, Type it in. I was like, just shut up. And it'll be 2113, baby. Um, let's see. Okay, four is two, two, two. <gasps> two, one, one, three, two. Come on, baby. Let's see if I can find it before you find it. <laughs> yeah, yes! bitch! Yes! Yes! <laughs> <laughs> I suck it! <laughs> dude, it. I just guessed it. <laughs> two, one, one, three, two. Suck it, dude. <laughs> But I like sucking it. Oh, I know. That's why I'm telling you. You're my buddy. I'm, I'm trying to make you happy. Yeah, yeah, right. <laughs> oh, my God. What the <laughs> fuck, man? Okay, I think you need to take that and throw it on the conveyor belts. Maybe I, I need to be chunky. Yeah, you gotta be chunkster. chunkster. But, uh, oh, but first things first, you need to get that grinder going. Yeah. I can't remember how. There's probably a switch or something. Let's go open the back door as chunky. Yeah. Oh, don't you have to open it as... Tiny? No. There, remember, it was cracked? I think I can just punch it. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I don't remember what side it's on. Anyway. Uh, shit. What were we talking about, man? I don't remember. Whatever. <laughs> Moving on. Moving on. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was talking about Borderlands. You brought up Claptrap. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, baby. I bet Borderlands fans were like, they forgot to talk about yeah. Borderlands. So, two announcements. Borderlands remastered. So, the first game. And then Borderlands Trace. 3. Yeah, and I'm stoked to meet uh, again. I'm sorry, Borderlands fans. I did not like Borderlands Two. Oh, uh, really? Not nearly as much as Borderlands One. Uh, not because I thought it was a bad game. I just I don't know the world. I was all icy in in the beginning, and it just didn't. I don't know. There's just something about it. It didn't it, like bring me in. You know? Yeah, I, I know that feeling. Like I I really love. Zelda Wind Waker, but playing Twilight Princess, something about it just doesn't click for me mm. quite as well, and I can't, it's hard to describe. Well, I just, it's a dark game, and you don't really like dark games. No, I, I, I like some dark, I wouldn't even say Twilight Princess is that dark. It's, it's kind of dark, but it's more dark, it's, it's like dark in that it's a more mature game compared to most Zelda games, but then you look at Majora's Mask, that game is truly dark in that it's scary and messed up. Uh -huh. Twilight Princess is not that messed up of a game. No. You remember that, that scene where you, uh... Or, was there anything else you wanted to say about Borderlands? Uh, no, but real quick. That just goes to outside, right? Yes, it does. Okay, so I can worry about that later. Um, wait, shouldn't? 
Wait a minute. I think so. But if you opened up the door, then why I would think, you need I to go in I think it's so that, that we can come in here at nighttime. Oh. Ah. As tiny. Clever, clever. I think. So, do you remember the cutscene in Twilight Princess where after you save Laneru, the light spirit of Laneru, you know, after you collect all the light bugs? Mm, which one, sorry? Um, in Lake Hylia. Nope. Well, after you get all the light bugs and restore Laneru, oh, right there. It gives he or she s says, "Let me tell you a story about the fused shadows and the sacred realm." Blah blah blah. Uh -huh. And it, it shows this cutscene of like these messed up people trying to get it, and then y you know Link's girlfriend in that game, Leah, I think is her name. Okay. She uh she appears in the cutscene, and suddenly there's like duplicates of her going upside down. They're like. <laughs> Just kind of laughing. Wait, how do they do it? <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> and uh -huh. the entire time I watch it, it, it's just like, it feels like they're trying to be dark and edgy, but I don't know. It feels really forced to me. Okay. That's my issue with Twilight Princess. The dark stuff feels a little too forced. Because mm. they can't go all the way with it because it's Nintendo. Yeah. They have to be family friendly enough. Damn it. Did I need to bring that? I had to bring that Wait. other one all the way. Are you fucking me? Wait, did you see? Wait. No, nah, it's on speed two out of three. I need to go get the other barrel. The other barrel. Damn it. Yeah. From the other place we were just in. Hmm. Rip. Okay. Uh, Where's Majora's Mask? Like, just it's just dark and f creepy and messed up, and it feels so effortless. Mm -hmm. It is a scary game. That game legit kind of scares me. And mm -hmm. whereas Twilight Princess is like, oh, we're so dark and mature and edgy. <laughs> Check this out, bro. It's like, uh, no. Yeah. No, look at Majora's Mask. You yeah. are a Majora's Mask poser. Okay. That's, I mean, that's fair. I, I get that feeling. It does feel less try-hardy. Yeah, yeah. Totes, it, my dude. Yeah, but, uh... Alright. <laughs> I mean, you, you know I like Majora's Mask way more. Oh, you love Majora's Mask. Uh, that's your favorite Zelda game. Sure do. I wonder when we'll play it on the show. Yeah, baby. Oh, there's the number. It was right up there. Oh, on the wall. Oh, my God. <laughs> You're right. Well, I guessed it, so suck it, nerd. Yeah, it's not like it was that hard to figure out. There's well, three switches, so. Okay. So. Cool. We can leave this area now. Um, we need to just come back here at nighttime so Tiny can fight the spider. Yeah, and there's a couple. I think there's still one more area we haven't been to in the daytime. Uh. Oh, yeah, then. Oh, yeah, we kind of got to come back here on the roof. I think we want to be Diddy. Oh, hey, hello. Oh. Hmm, where does the tube bring you? Oh, yeah, you want to go yet. through there, but... Oh, wait. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, I see. They're tiny. Feathers. Tiny okay, feathers. Okay, tiny can open that. All right. Mm. All right, let's just go uh, with number two. Boing. Yeet. Yeah, but what are your thoughts on Twilight Princess overall? Um, it's probably my least memorable Zelda game, 3D Zelda game. Really? Mm-hmm. Mm. I just don't... Oh, my God. I saw the red, and I was like, Diddy! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, man. I didn't even Actually, think you know what? We still... There are things around here for Diddy. Let's just go ahead and grab that. Oh yeah, there's the... Um... Jetpack. Yeah, which was... I think you just walked past it. Yeah, but there's also these I was looking for. Bananas. Bananas. Watch me whip. Watch me banana. Who sings that song? Uh, I don't know. Watch me whip. Watch me nanny. I don't know yeah. who sings it. But... What do I gotta do up here? Um... It's pro that's probably just a shortcut to reach the... Is there something on here? Yeah. It's... Not really. I mean, the jetpack's probably just a shortcut to get back up there to hit the switch a little bit quicker. Probably, but I'm double-checking this crap. Oh, maybe once you, uh... Maybe nighttime or something. I don't know. Hmm. Okay, cool. We've done this. Um, I can't believe you've done this. <laughs> All right. There's also these, real quick. People freaking love that video. Yeah. Oh, fuck, I can't believe you've done this. <laughs> he just says it so seriously. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think it's as funny as a lot of other people do, but I I, I, get, I think it's funny. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. Ah, uh, shit. Yeah, I just, I don't know. Twilight Princess is fine. I like Skyward Sword better. I like Majora's Mask. I like all of them better. That's you like Skyward Sword better? Yeah. That's funny because I know you hate the controls. Oh my god, yeah, I do. The that controls are better in Twilight. Biggest detractor, and it holds your hand way too much. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Skyward Sword and Twilight Princess both have like really long openings oh, that take a while to get past. 
Yeah. I, I'd say that's definitely a huge plus for uh, uh, Breath of the Wild. Yeah. It just sh throws you right into the game. Isn't the uh, remake of Twilight Princess more like the GameCube version? Oh, the, oh, the one for uh, Wii U? Yeah. Uh, yeah. It's not mirrored, because the Wii version is mirrored so that Link would, could be right-handed. Yeah, yeah. Um, you yeah, know, the, the Wii U port, a change HD barrel. port is, uh... Yeah, there should be a change barrel over here. Okay. Oh, yeah, you gotta fight some killer tomatoes yeah, over yeah, here. Yeah, I remember that. Oops. Please help me. <laughs> I don't want to forget... Hold on. I'm dumping in that barrel first, because I will forget that one fucking banana for Tiny, or the two, and that's gonna suck. Well, you'll have to remember it for the next few minutes, because next time on Royal Goobs... I'm gonna get him right now and then end the episode, baby. Uh oh. That was only one? That's... that's evil. <laughs> that's fucking evil, man. I can't find the one banana! Fuck you, player! Nah.